Hey everybody, it's Alvin Brown, CEO and founder of the Center for Healing and Peak Performance and Integrated Peak Performance Consulting Services, as well as author of Journey to Personal Greatness, Mind, Body, and Soul, which is a book that's got chock full of information on it for life balance and self-mastery. Now we're here with Short and Sweet, another edition. I'm bringing a friend again, our in-house doctor of naturopath. We're here with Short and Sweet. Today we're going to talk about Candida and how it affects your peak performance. Now I'm going to give, it, give the rest of the way to our doctor here, Dr. Joanne Mina, as she tells us, gives us some gospel on Candida. Dr. Joanne. Okay, so I'm going to go through a few points on what Candida is, what it's all about, how to identify it, and then what's the next thing that you need to do if you think you've got Candida issues. So first and foremost, Candida is a bacteria. Um, candida gets a lot of slack out there and most people think, ooh, candida is such a bad thing. However, we actually do need it systemically. We do need it in order for um, our gut to produce and uh, absorb and digest nutrients properly. The thing is we don't want an overgrowth of candida. So candida, this, the, the specific species is called candida albicans and it actually exists all over our body from, uh, from our skin to internally to our organs, our reproductive tract or gastrointestinal tract. So we, we do need it, but we just need it in that perfect balance. Okay, so how do you identify if you've got an overgrowth of candida? Well, some of the more obvious symptoms are going to be skin and fungal nail infections. Even eye infections can be caused by an overgrowth of candida. Then you've got things like um, genital, yeast infections, vaginal infections. And then you've got some not so obvious symptoms like bloating, bowel issues, even difficulty concentrating and poor memory. So for example, if you're an athlete and you're looking to really excel in your sport and, and you want to have that top notch peak performance level, um, and you're experiencing these symptoms, I would definitely say look at uh, digestively what's going on, maybe get tested to see if you've got an overgrowth of candida in your system to see if that is impeding from you to getting to your optimal level health where you want to be. Some other things that candida can manifest into are uh, SIBO, which stands for small intestinal bacterial overgrowth. That's a little bit more of a complex condition that candida can cause. So what happens is candida and all its friends get together and they form this film of a blanket that protects it. So it actually makes it a lot more difficult for us to treat it and cure it and get rid of it because it's now got the super barrier. So it can turn into things like this small intestinal bacterial overgrowth. Um, like I said, causing biofilms. So what's the next step, course in action to do? Number one, get tested. You always want to rule out certain things, so you want to test. You can test either through blood, uh, stool samples, and also urine to see if candida overgrowth is an issue. Then uh, next I would say eliminate uh, certain sugars, eliminate alcohol because that actually feeds the candida growth and you also want to eliminate certain inflammatory carbohydrates. And then the last step you're going to want to do is heal the gut. So it's one thing to eliminate the excess sugars in your diet, but then it's another to actually repair all the damage that the candida has done. Now, I got a good question for you. Mm -hmm. What about male, female? What about male it? struggle with? Absolutely, and that's another uh, stereotype too. When people think yeast infections, they think, oh, it's just, a, it's just a woman issue, guys don't have to worry about it. When in actuality, it does, because candida is a bacteria that exists in both male and female um, organs as well, males can definitely be affected. So they can get things like the same things like bloating issues, uh, fatigue, difficulty concentrating, and then you get more specific things like genitally, they'll get uh, certain symptoms if candida is an overgrowth issue. So it's, that's great to know. That's a question I've always gotten to, and may, we often think yeast infection and candida overgrowth, mostly female predominant, but remember guys, brain fog, all the other symptoms, that could be yours too. So today, short and sweet, candida can affect your peak performance. For more information and to follow up on this, and to even just pick her, uh, Dr. Mina's brain, you have, we have free 20 minute, 50 minute consults, just give us a call, I'll scroll the ticker down bottom, connect with us, we're here to help. That's our main goal is to help you to get to your level of peak performance. That is why we call it that. And it doesn't matter if you are an elite athlete, stay at home mom, 80 years old, it doesn't matter. You want peak performance for your level of health and your level of activity 
And again, we're here for you. Alvin Brown, Dr. Joanne Mina, give us a call and we'll talk to you later.